oh wow it looks like kafka summit london announcement just came out which means that all speakers in all sessions are published and also i will break this down for you let's get to it Hi, this is Victor Gavin from Confluent. Being a developer advocate, I'm truly blessed to travel places to talk about things like Kafka, stream processing, cloud, and Confluent. And today I'm happy to be in Aventura, Florida, where I would like to break down some of the sessions from Kafka Summit London that I'm personally excited about. All right, so this year I had the honor and pleasure to be part of Kafka Summit program committee. We had over 300 proposals, which means that there were a huge number of awesome talks that we can choose from. All right, so uh, there are many talks that will be presented during Kafka Summit. I want to choose only my favorite that I'm personally excited about. <clears throat> so when I was just getting started in the Kafka world, one of the first presentation I've seen is a presentation by Michael Knoll. Michael was presenting in one conference in Berlin where he was explaining the difference between event time and processing time using Star Wars as example. How cool is that? If you haven't seen this talk, you can go and search this online. But this year in London, Michael is going to be talking about things that every software engineer needs to know about streams and tables. And I'm wondering what kind of metaphor he's going to be using this time. If you're a fan of Legend of Zelda, you definitely need to attend Anna McDonald's talk where she will be teaching you how to develop a perfect Kafka Streams topology. Choose your own topology, a Kafka Streams adventure. Next, Florent Hosenois. Florent, if I'm spelling your last name incorrectly, I hope we still can be friends. During his presentation, he will be coding his production-ready Kafka Streams application using Ascara Streams, which is lightweight Java library that allows you to focus on important things like developing your topology, rather than focusing on infrastructure, configurations in all this ceremony. Hmm. While designing multi-tenant systems where performance is a very important factor, you need to consider multiple things, especially when your workload are highly unpredictable like they are in managed Kafka service. Anna Povsner, engineer from Confluent Cloud, will break down the challenges that her team overcome while developing truly multi-tenant system in the cloud. Reactive manifesto and reactive programming. Have you ever thought how this thing will impact you as a developer while you develop Kafka Streams applications or any Kafka producing consumer application. If it's something that you might find interesting, please join this dynamic duo from IBM, Kate Stanley and Grace Jensen. But what about DevOps topics, Victor? This is pure developer stuff so far. Well, this is why we have Mitch Henderson. Mitch developed a particular set of skills skills he acquired being a technical account manager, skills that make him a best friend for people like you, my dear operators. So this is why you don't want to miss his talk. Learnings from the field from Mitch Henderson. Be there. All right, so as of me, I'm gonna be talking about a very important, but sometimes forgotten topic. No, this time it's not security, but it's testing. Come to my talk and learn how not to be this person. You know what kind of person I'm talking about. The person who tests all applications and all the stuff in production. So come to my talk, learn about testing of your Kafka applications, Kafka Streams applications, and even KSQL DB applications. Also, I invite you to use my personal code, gamov 30 It's like my last name, 30, that gives you 30% discount from the standard ticket. I hope to see you in London and as always, have a nice day.